There's former 135 pound Anthony Yoni. Former. Still going it. Got my next fight. Still, still the champ, but Never no longer up. 135 pounds. <laughs> no, like 165 now. Yeah. 65. But he weighed 60 the other day. Huh. See, he's watching my weight all the time. <laughs> I was getting texts when I was home. He's like, keep your weight down, keep your weight down. Never know. Like, ugh. Oh. What's your next fight? I don't know. May 8th? At, at, at 35 or? 45. 45. Maybe. Very good. When's our next fight, right? Uh, you're just making things yeah, up. Yeah, I was making that up. <laughs> I'd like to fight May 8th, though. There you go. Ready to go up, up to the house, Anthony? Anthony yeah, gets to eat finally. Pretty much like a good show. When I eat, I get real fat. You're, you're, you're a couple minutes too late, man. <laughs> you missed out. Squad. Indeed. It's like everybody's eating, there's babies sleeping. And you prepared this fine meal? <laughs> Usually. <laughs> Chef right there. We got, we got a team chef. So, how is it having all these guys in your house? Oh, I'm so used to it now. Uh huh. We're always here. Ask her what I don't You didn't say that whether that was good or bad. You're just used to it. <laughs> you know what? It's good. If it means that my husband can also be here. So, you know? That's Otherwise, true. he would have to be away. And <laughs> and I need things done, like vacuuming and you know, stuff like that. So it's good that he's here. Uh -huh. Very good. <laughs> Take Vader's for walks when yeah. Ryan's at fights. You know? Oh, yeah. They all help out around here. Yeah. And he does all the chores around here. Mm-hmm. We got, yeah. we got chores every day. <laughs> what are your chores, Ken? They're just random. <laughs> just take them as they come. Yesterday I had to go pick up towels, right? He, Ryan usually makes like a peace offering with me first. Like he'll come downstairs, I'll be asleep, he'll shake my foot and be like, you want a cup of coffee? And then, <laughs> and then if, I, if, if I come up and drink that cup of coffee, that means I'm going to have some chores later. <laughs> Basically. It's a barter system. That's exactly how that is every morning. Exactly. <laughs> how come he doesn't do that to Leone? Can't wake him up. He's evil. He ain't getting up. <laughs> he doesn't get up. <laughs> Alright, Kenny installed some fine tile for us. Yeah. In yeah. the bathroom next door. Nice job, Ken. Thank you. Paid your way. My dad would be proud. <laughs> Hey, Kenny, okay, tell us about like the little fairies around here that steal stuff and hide it, and they take all your stuff, your phone, and they hide it. And... Yeah, I know you guys got a clothing company now. If you guys make fanny packs, Kenny needs one. We're looking to get. Yeah, can I get a fanny pack or what? Leave me alone. We need a sleek, modern-looking fanny pack for Kenny to wear so he can keep all his valuables. I don't think there is such a thing. <laughs> They were going on a date last weekend, uh, Kenny and Pat Bennett, a double date, right? It was a blind, it was a blind date for Pat Bennett, and uh, <laughs> Kenny will tell you how it went, but you know how on Jersey Shore, they um, they always say like they need to do their GTL, the gym painting and laundry, and Kenny's like, before I leave, I need my phone, my tooth, and my wallet. <laughs> so he's PTW now, instead of GTL. That is, I, 
<laughs> I've been like, it got so out of hand for like a month where I, I was like getting late to everything every day, whether it's practice, work, or what. Now I'm just phone, wallet, tooth, phone, wallet, tooth, <laughs> everywhere. I'm just double checking. But like, dude, but the damn, but you know, the, the couch, that couch swallows shit. It swallows my, my things. Who was, was it you or was Bennett? There was a pocket. Uh, uh, like a, a, a material in in the back of the couch where if it fell through the seat it would fall into a little pocket of whatever and there was I'm surprised I didn't you just pull out like right old now. phones and That's, money. That wasn't originally our couch so if you found anything good in there. Yeah, no, I was finding like money and stuff and all the <laughs> dollars of change that fall down there. That's probably from the tooth fairy. It is. <laughs> Under I'm beat, man. Yeah. <laughs> First hard weekend in a couple of weeks, just kind of starting off the training camp for Corey Hill. I'm feeling it. Yeah, that'll be a good fight, huh, Corey Hill? Hopefully. It's, uh, well, I mean, it has the potential to be a good fight. It's a crazy matchup, you know? We're on such opposite ends of the spectrum, you know? Right, he's got, like, what, 6'3"? Yeah, I mean, they got him listed at, like, 6'3", 6'4". You know, I'm about all of 5'7", you know, yeah, on, a, exactly. on a tall day, so. Yeah. Um, yeah, it should, should be interesting. You know, he's got a wrestling background. I got a wrestling background. So that could mean anything from, uh, you know, stand-up war to, uh, you know, who knows, man. I'm just hoping for another good performance, a lot of action. I want to push the pace and, you know, have an exciting fight. You know, I'm kind of, now I think I'm more, I, I don't worry so much about wins and losses as I want to just perform well. You know, mm -hmm. everything goes into just having that good performance, you know, and I feel like if, as long as I do that and perform to the best of my ability, you know, the, the wins will take care of themselves sure. at that point. And that kind of, you know, that kind of came to fruition in my last fight. You know, I think mentally I, I was in a better place than I've ever been going into that fight. Just, you know, just th thinking about things going into it and how you're visualizing and, you know, I just, everything I thought about it just was, you know, positive for me. Mm -hmm. So I kind of... Hoping to keep everything going on the same wavelength for this one. You know? Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Be good. Yeah, you guys gonna come up? Yeah. Awesome. May fifth. Eight. May eighth. May eighth. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Hey, Do you got a treat for me? Go get your bucket. Where's your bucket? Be our mascot. Yeah. Mm -hmm.